welcome to an episode of Co-Pilot Conversations with me, your host, Matilda Ottoman. This is the series where I will bring a guest for every episode, and I will have them sit in my passenger seat. I will ask them questions so you can get to know them. We'll play a game for your entertainment. I hope that sounds like a good time to you. Let's go pick up our guest. And then I brought, like, two other outfits with me. Ready? Yep. Here's your... A mocha frappuccino. I didn't get whips because I wasn't sure if it was vegan or not, but I didn't get it. It's fine. Thank you. <laughs> okay, no problem. My parking brake is on. I forgot how to drive. How are you? How's, I'm good. How's everything? I'm good. I'm so good. good. Okay, for the people that don't know who you are, you're a bit of a social media. <laughs> just a little bit social media famous, I would say. Just a little bit. Just a little Working bit. on it right now. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> so how do we know each other? Tell people how we know each other. Because we met in Mr. I can't believe I'm saying Mr. So that's so disgusting. I'm gonna bleep it out. We met in his class and she was just like the person in the best way possible. And I was like, we have to be friends. You're going to university, you're going to college. I know. In the fall. Oh my God. When do you leave? I leave at the end of August after my birthday, which is the 27th. That's good. Okay. Yes. And what are you planning to study? Law, but I'm probably not gonna do that to be honest. Why? Like, I'm just not. I'm going to be famous, just <laughs> so you guys know, and I'm going to be doing a lot of creative work. Like, I'm getting the degree just because, like, you need one of those to, like, survive. That just in case sense. everything fails and, like, I turn ugly or something, <laughs> like, then I'll get the law degree. Well, I'll have it already, and, you know, I'll just do that. Just in case. And where are you in your school? London. Hey. Yes. <laughs> and you visited London the first time? Yeah. Wait, you have to okay. tell, you have to tell <laughs> the story. <laughs> So, so I went to London originally in the summer of 2016, and they sent my ass home. And like, I didn't even get to enter the country. It was the most awful experience of my life. I was in airport jail. It was disgusting. I didn't eat for like two days. Like I was crying. It was it was the worst experience That's ever. So terrible. I, and all because you were not 18. All because I wasn't 18. But you went back this yes. past spring yep. spring break. Yep. And you had a blast. Yes, did I did. It, it made up for everything. I was like, this is fine. That's good. Yeah. Is your mom excited to move you <laughs> across yeah. the across the world? Yeah, she's going to be an empty nester. Aww. That's, that's great. You're working on, you have a blog. Yes, just started that. Nice, nice. And what do you, is that like a... It's a lifestyle, lifestyle blog. blog? It's okay. a lifestyle blog, really. And then my YouTube channel is coming. I tried it, and I was like, "You, this is gross. Like, can't do this." So I'm revamping it now. I have more time. It's summer. That's good. What is your YouTube channel like? Give us like a gist, just a, like a little taste. So. To be honest, I'm just gonna be talking about bull <laughs> just everything about my life, like what it's like to be black in London, to be a black like American in London, because I feel like that's a different experience than like being like an African in London or like something else I don't know I want to talk about like just music I love music like I feel like I'm gonna make music one day I don't know I feel like I, am. I could see that happening like I love real. music and then really just story time because I have a lot of weird stuff that happens to me so I feel like everyone should hear about it because my life is just really I totally agree your life is so <laughs> exciting <laughs> it's just to be honest. it's a lot you're also vegan you've yeah. been vegan for a year Yes, a year? I made a year in April. Yeah, that's, I think, how did you start, like, how did you decide, that's not the right way. So how did you decide to become vegan? When did you say, I'm going to do this, mm -hmm. it's going to be my life, like, To be honest, like, it was like April 2015, and I had already been wanting to do it. I've tried to be vegetarian, like, twice, like, it didn't work. And I was like, I'm finally going to, like, cut everything cold turkey, like, I'm just going to try this out. And I did, and... To be honest, I did it more for health reasons. Like, I didn't give a f about the animals. Like, sorry. I love animals, but at the end of the day, like, they're going to die. I've been doing it for a year. It's really fun. And I just got your frappuccino. <laughs> That's super healthy. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I've been slacking. I had, like, vegan cheese fries yesterday. Ooh. They were so good. Cheese fries, anything is good. I know. In any way, shape, or form. I know. I don't care if they're vegan or not. Give me cheese fries. <laughs> to be honest, like, I'm trying to find a place to Oh my god, what is, that? what is going on? <laughs> Can you bleep out my curse words? I feel like that would be so much fun. Oh, I think I will bleep out all the curse words because I'm trying to like censor myself a little more. I have the bleep app on my phone. <laughs> so I can literally censor myself whenever I want. And I oh can just god. be like, like, okay, that's not on, but it's so much fun. Okay, we're gonna play a game. Oh, no, <laughs> it's not gonna be that bad. Okay. <laughs> this is the 
Name 5 game. Have you ever played that? No. So there's like a timer and you have to, like it tells you like to name five things in like that category. Mm -hmm. And you just have to like go for it. Name three popes. I don't fucking know. They all look like the same <laughs> person. I literally don't know any popes. You don't even know what? Francis. <laughs> That's it. That's the only one that matters. <laughs> Okay, my turn. Name three things with legs. Uh, ants, uh, uh, bees, uh, <laughs> dogs. <laughs> Wait! You didn't put sun! <laughs> ants, bees, dogs! <laughs> I got it! You got it. So. That's just me. Okay, ready? Name three countries in Africa. Mozambique, Nigeria, and Kenya. Yes! <laughs> I know my Africa! <laughs> I feel like that's such an important thing to like know. Like you need to know your Africa. You need you to know your roots. You need to know your Africa. Okay. Everyone needs to know Africa. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually press it this time. Okay. <laughs> Name three movies starring Ryan Gosling. Um, La La Land, uh, The Notebook, and uh, crap. I do not know any. Oh, oh, f <laughs> I don't remember that. Name three things below the sink. Shampoo, conditioner, and shea butter. Yeah. I mean, that's my sink, though. You gotta Any stay strapped with that shea butter. <laughs> Anything goes. Okay. Name three things you can put in a bag. Uh, a camera, a phone, a wallet. Legend. Yes. These aren't that hard. The one like the, that comes in like the board game style, That those are hard. I don't know really? why. Yeah. Mm. Name three songs by Rihanna. <laughs> Umbrella. Say my, wait, say my name. What the f no! Okay! <laughs> We're cutting this! We're cutting this! I was about to say say it, and I said say my name because like I was thinking about Beyonce this morning. I am sorry so to all my funny. Rihanna fans out there. You did not get what the it! F I was thinking about say it and, and what's, what's my name, name and like it just turned into like something very bad. <laughs> name three things which stink. Um skunks, uh gym socks, no, and gym. my brother. <laughs> Facts, y'all. These are facts. Party. Name three mathematical symbols. Cosine, sine, and tangent. Does that count? I don't know. Those are okay. Those are plus, swing. subtract, and multiply. If that doesn't count, because I feel like I'm gonna give it to you. Symbols. I think that's fair. Three shopping malls. Go. Uh, Deerbrook, uh, Memorial City, and uh, Willowbrook. Ooh, you got it. Like just barely. Houston. Mark. All right, last one. All right. Oh wait, it's yours and then mine. Name three ways you pollute the environment. By being a <laughs> and smoking cigarettes, um, trash, and then like, <laughs> I don't <laughs> know. Like, how do we pollute the environment? Like, that's a good question. Last one for okay. me. Let's do it. Three artists. Uh, like. A, of any uh, sort. Uh, Picasso, uh, <laughs> I don't yeah. Michelangelo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was a good All right. I think that was a pretty successful episode. What do you think? I think it's pretty yeah. There are a lot of bleeps you have to make. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's fine. I need to like, get used to it because I do it a lot and like I want to be genuine. I want to I want people to like see me on the street, like people who watch my videos, if they ever like meet me in real life and be like, "Oh my gosh, she's just like she is on her videos." like be genuine but also like i'm trying to get that money thank you guys so much for watching this episode of co-pilot conversations let me know who else you want me to have in my passenger seat uh you can follow me on twitter and instagram at talk to matilda and you can find tyler on ho no one cur with three r's i'll put her right here <laughs> on uh twitter yeah oh it's instagram too okay yeah. nice should i leave a link to your your blog yeah you can yeah. yeah, and be sure to check her out on YouTube when she, you know, gets that going. I'll put a link in the yes. description so you can prepare for that. We are going to go, and I will see you guys next time with a brand new video. Bye. Bye-bye.